Hello, this is Francisco Cribari, and today I want to briefly talk about an IDE, a graphical interface that I use to when I'm typesetting my LaTeX documents. I use LaTeX to produce my papers, my academic papers, my professional presentations, my Vita, and so on. And there are several uh, graphical interfaces that one can use. Tech Studio is an excellent uh, graphical interface, an excellent uh, IDE, but that's not a, what I use. But I recommend that you take a look at uh, Tech Studio. What I use, by the way, if you have no idea what LaTeX is, you may want to take a look at uh, the Wikipedia page. It's basically a markup uh, language for typesetting, as it's excellent. And I use it to produce papers and my academic uh, presentations and lecture notes and, and so on. And I use Kyo. I'm not sure if that's the correct pronunciation, but that's what I use. Uh, K I L E, which is uh, a KDE application. And I want to show you the changes that I make to the configuration. I go to settings, configured Kayo, and um, I go to editor. Let me see here, editor. And in appearance, I check here dynamic word wrap so that the lines don't extend beyond the window length. And the next thing that I do, I go to fonts and colors and I select the font that I want to use. I kind of like uh, using the hack font but you can choose another font if you wish and um, after that I go to editing come here to indentation and change this field here to none I don't want to have any default indentation sometimes I have some verbatim uh, code in my articles or in my presentations and I don't want um, any default indentation in that area and next I go to tools build and I add here new a new entry which is Bieber for references and I just add here Bieber and um, percentage sign s in advanced run outside kyo compile bcf and bbl in source extension and target extension okay next i go to bibtech and uh, using this option here new i add bibber here you see Bieber, same thing, BCF, BBL, and um, so that I can use Bibtech or Bieber as backend to my reference. I leave this here in default and I make sure that under PDF LaTeX here, in general, this option is selected automatically run additional tools it's usually checked but um, I always double check that so this, that's basically the changes that I make to the configurations everything else is uh, perfect so if I if I press ALT 6 it runs PDF LaTeX if I press Alt 7, it opens Ocular with the PDF that it has just produced. This is a paper that I'm working on right now. And um, Alt 1, it uh, quickly 
builds my document and you can see here the shortcuts in build compile see and convert view so I use all those shortcuts and uh, it's an excellent uh, tool I use it daily and I recommend but I suggest you also take a look at uh, Tech Studio you may like it better but uh, to my liking Kyo is the best uh, IDE for LaTeX